Hello, Linux enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving deep into the world of Linux distributions. In this comprehensive video, we'll be comparing two of the most influential choices in the Linux community, Debian and Arch Linux. So, if you're at a crossroads, trying to figure out which distribution aligns with your preferences and needs, you're in the right place. Stick around as we explore various facets that might just help you make that crucial decision. Let's get started. Choosing a Linux distribution can be a daunting task with the plethora of options available. Each distribution has its own unique set of characteristics, catering to different user preferences and workflows. In today's video, we'll be shedding light on Debian and Arch Linux, two giants in the Linux world. Debian is celebrated for its stability, and Arch Linux is renowned for its simplicity and user centricity. Let's see how they measure up against each other. First and foremost, let's delve into the philosophies that guide Debian and Arch Linux, shaping their core principles and intended user base. Debian embraces the essence of free and open source software, ensuring that its repository is a haven for such software. Stability and reliability are the cornerstones of Debian's philosophy, making it a go-to choice for server environments. Developed and maintained by a passionate community, Debian stands as a testament to the collaborative spirit that drives the open source world. On the flip side, Arch Linux adheres to the, keep it simple, stupid, philosophy. Prioritizing simplicity and flexibility, Arch empowers users to take full control of their systems. Arch isn't for the faint-hearted, it's tailored for advanced Linux users who appreciate a hands-on approach. And let's not forget the rolling release model, a constant evolution that keeps Arch Linux at the forefront of Linux innovations. Now, let's dive into the critical realm of stability and reliability, factors that can significantly impact your overall experience with a Linux distribution. Debian stands as a paragon of stability, considered rock-solid and perfect for server and production environments. Packages undergo meticulous testing, ensuring a robust and reliable system. However, this emphasis on stability may mean that some packages in Debian's repositories are slightly outdated, catering more to those who prioritize stability over bleeding-edge features. Arch Linux takes a different approach with its rolling release model, providing users with continuous updates. Despite its reputation for potential breakages, many Arch users report stable systems with regular updates. It's a testament to the user's responsibility in keeping their system up to date for a seamless experience. Security is a paramount concern in today's digital landscape. Let's explore how Debian and Arch Linux address this crucial aspect. Debian places a high priority on security, boasting a dedicated team actively monitoring and addressing vulnerabilities. Regular security updates are pushed out promptly, ensuring a secure and resilient system. Arch Linux also places a strong emphasis on security, providing timely updates. However, owing to its rolling release nature, there's a possibility that new updates may introduce occasional bugs. Despite this, security issues in Arch Linux are relatively rare. The installation process can be a make-or-break moment for users. Let's explore how Debian and Arch Linux handle this crucial phase. Debian offers a user-friendly installation process, guiding users through each step. The process is straightforward, making it accessible for a broad spectrum of users, from beginners to seasoned Linux enthusiasts. In contrast, Arch Linux takes a hands-on approach to installation. No graphical installer here, you manually install Arch. This might seem intimidating for newcomers but fear not, there are scripts available to simplify the process, making Arch Linux approachable even for those new to the Linux scene. Performance is a key factor in determining the overall efficiency of your Linux system. Let's see how Debian and Arch Linux perform in this crucial area. Debian, with its inclusive approach, may experience slightly slower performance due to pre-installed software. However, for many users, this trade-off is acceptable for the convenience of having everything ready out of the box. In Arch Linux, users have control over what software to install and keep, resulting in faster performance. Without unnecessary bloatware, Arch often outperforms other distributions. With up-to-date software, Arch Linux consistently delivers top-notch performance, making it particularly suitable for gaming. It's no wonder SteamOS chose Arch Linux as its base. Now, let's explore the availability of software in Debian and Arch Linux, a crucial consideration for users with specific software needs. Debian boasts one of the largest repositories, prioritizing free and open source software. With thousands of packages to choose from, it caters to a wide range of user requirements. However, Debian strictly adheres to FOSS in its official repository, and users seeking proprietary software may need to turn to external sources. Arch Linux offers a unique approach with both free and proprietary software available in its repositories. 
While the official repository might be smaller compared to other distributions, the Arch User Repository Our, expands the software selection dramatically. Our becomes a treasure trove for users, offering almost any software ever made for Linux. Ensuring compatibility with your hardware is vital for a smooth user experience. Let's see how Debian and Arch Linux handle hardware compatibility. Debian's official version focuses on free drivers, potentially causing compatibility issues with hardware lacking such drivers. However, the non-free community edition resolves this by offering access to non-free drivers, addressing most compatibility concerns. Arch Linux ships with both free and non-free drivers out of the box, ensuring broader hardware compatibility. Notably, certain NVIDIA drivers, primarily built for Ubuntu, often perform better when installed on Arch Linux, showcasing its flexibility. Let's shift our focus to how these distributions handle updates, a crucial aspect in keeping your system secure and up-to-date. Debian follows a well-defined but not fixed release cycle, with stable versions released every two years. LTS versions provide extended support. Testing and unstable branches offer a rolling release experience, although a few months behind the bleeding edge. This diverse approach caters to users with varying preferences. Arch Linux stands out with its rolling release model, doing away with major versions. Updates are released continuously, and once you install Arch, you're set to update indefinitely. This eliminates the need for major distribution updates, providing users with a seamless and ever-evolving experience. Having a supportive community can greatly enhance your Linux journey. Let's see how Debian and Arch Linux communities measure up. Debian boasts a large and dedicated community, maintaining forums, mailing lists, and IRC channels. Despite lacking the backing of a major corporation, Debian users actively assist each other. The Debian community is known for its helpfulness, fostering an environment where users can seek assistance, discuss, and collaborate. The Arch Linux community is renowned for its helpful and supportive nature. Forums, IRC channels, and other platforms provide a space for Arch users to collaborate and assist each other. Notably, Reddit houses one of the most active Arch Linux communities, showcasing the willingness of Arch users to help others navigate the intricacies of the distribution. Now, the moment of truth, which distribution is right for you. If stability and reliability top your priorities, if you prefer a well-defined release cycle and long-term support, if you value ease of use and a user-friendly experience, and if you require a vast array of pre-compiled software packages, Debian might be your ideal choice. If you desire a highly customizable Linux experience, if staying up to date with the latest software versions excites you, if you possess a good understanding of Linux and prefer a hands-on, do-it-yourself approach, if you want the flexibility to choose your own desktop environment or window manager, and if you're comfortable troubleshooting and configuring your system, then Arch Linux might be the perfect fit for you. And there you have it, a detailed comparison between Debian and Arch Linux. Both distributions have their own set of advantages and disadvantages, catering to different user preferences. The choice ultimately comes down to your specific needs and how you want to interact with your Linux system. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Happy Linuxing, and until next time, stay curious.